Do you know the difference between your salad fork and dinner fork? How about the proper way to excuse yourself after a meal? We're at Bay Point for the Career Center Dining Etiquette class to find out. Delicious smells wafted through the air as Roger Williams students were given a first-hand look at good table manners. It's, in, uh, it's intimidating when you're invited to a formal setting like the president's house or someplace and you're not sure which fork to use, which knife to use, what do I do with my napkin. Preparing for interviews are stressful enough, but the Career Center sponsored dining event hopes to prevent students from making a feasting faux pas. I think it's very important because every once in a while you may have a second interview over a meal at a restaurant or for lunch and you want to be able to be prepared because you never get a second chance to make a first impression. And the night made a lasting impression on diners who indulged on a four course meal including soup, salad, an entree and dessert. However, it is John Small's coaching which resonated the most. Um, it was definitely very helpful. I enjoyed it. You know, I was with my softball team so it was a little bit more comfortable but I mean, you know, some of the questions you're like, oh yeah, I'm kind of wondering that too. So it was kind of nice to, you know, get those out in the open. All in attendance that night left with not only a full stomach but a full plate of etiquette knowledge. 59 students attended the etiquette night and are now hopefully one step closer to avoiding a dining disaster. Reporting at Bay Point for Digital Journalism, I'm Jessica Graves.